Shalonda Brown is a DHS child welfare specialist from Genesee County working on the MySacWIS project. She helped design the application and now is assisting in preparation activities for field users. She'll now take you through a brief overview of the determination of care, also known as DOC. Here's Shalonda. Thanks. DOC is an assessment that will be completed by DHS and private agency workers to justify when providers should receive additional funds due to extraordinary care or expenses to address the needs of a child. Once logged into MySACWIS, select the Financial tab. This will take you to the Service Search Criteria screen. In the Navigational panel, click on Service Authorization. The list screen appears displaying all pending service authorization records. The filter allows you to narrow your search. Entering in the child's person ID and clicking on Filter takes you to the Service Authorization Detail screen where you will see Service Authorization for the person filtered. Next, select the Add Amount button, which takes you to the add-on screen. Then enter the cost reason of Determination of Care from the drop-down list. Now select the Determination of Care link to access the DHS 470 470A or 1945. MySACWIS will automatically determine which assessment to complete according to the child's age. Once the form is complete, select Calculate and the application will automatically determine the DOC level and score. Now that the necessary information is complete, you will select OK to save and return to the add-on screen. Enter the begin and end date, then click Calculate to determine the add-on cost amount. Once the assessment and scores are determined, click the Approval button and the DOC is sent to the assigned supervisor for review and approval. The worker is able to monitor the status or history of the DOC in the Service Authorization Detail screen. This displays the cost reason, add-on amount, effective date, end date, and DOC approval status. Thanks for taking a few minutes to explore how to create, calculate, and submit the DOC. This short overview was produced to help you understand how the DOC process will integrate in MySACWIS and help you become more familiar with the application. If you have any questions pertaining to MySACWIS, please send them to your agency's MySACWIS liaison for submission to the project staff. Your questions will be added to the Frequently Asked Questions document that is regularly updated on the MySACWIS website.